Okay, well it's daylight now. Um, it seems that my uh, my cheap stills camera can only record three minutes of video, so uh, I'm going to have to uh, pick this video up back uh, where I left off. It's a good thing I haven't touched the system since uh, since I did the previous video. Um, but we're back where we uh, where we started, and uh, let's have a quick uh, a quick look at that um, uh, pie chart that I did before because I noticed that uh, it didn't come out too well. So we could zoom in a little bit, and you can see uh, see that, and you can see where the documents overlapped with it. And there's my uh, file browser and stuff and um, you can see the uh, thumbnails that come up when, uh, when you go to the start menu and stuff. I even found a use for the uh, for the ripple effect um, because uh, when you get an application that uh, that needs your attention on the windows it flashes the uh, the button on the start bar and uh, here I get the same thing but I can make it uh, I can make it make ripples so you uh, you can't miss it which is nice. So we're about to uh, we're about to log on to Warcraft, and I'm conscious that we're going to run out of time if I uh, don't do this quickly. And I was I was about to uh, explain to you why this sometimes goes uh, goes grey for a second as it logs in, um, which is because the uh, the system monitors all the applications, and if uh, if one of them looks like it might have crashed, it uh, it just greys it while it's not uh, while it's not responding. So you can see um, if your browser stops working, you can see whether it's uh, it's uh, it's crashed or it's just waiting for something. But uh, Warcraft only ever uh, only ever does it during login, and, uh, and it comes back within uh, a second or two. So that's pretty good. This is the uh, the free Windows emulator that comes with it, um, and uh, I've never played uh, World of Warcraft under uh, under Windows. Um, I've done level uh, one to sixty five quite uh, quite adequately without um, without the need for Windows. So quite, quite happy with that. And everybody that's uh, that's played this will have uh, will have discovered uh, Thoughtbot, which uh, I think is quite important. Um, but obviously, if uh, I'm going to pretend I haven't got a second screen now, because normally I'd run it over there. But uh, but if you do that and you put it over your normal uh, screen, something's going to sneak up on you and uh, and it's going to be a problem. So what I normally would do would be to uh, to just shade it out a little bit, so you can um, so you can see what you're uh, what you're doing, and you can um, you can uh, you can uh, Fight quite adequately with the uh, with the web browser still up there. Um, quite a nice uh, nice hit, and you can uh, you, know, you can have a have a run around and uh, and browse at the same time. Let's uh, pick something there. And uh, I wonder if all these things are going to change. Yeah, they are. So I'm just finish.